Hi there guys, I'm Chris Bowden and you're not. And I'm Paul Kidwell. Welcome to the Geek Group where once again we're deep in our underground super secret bunker under Cayenne Mountain. Yep. Where we're going to modify the Nerf Long Strike CS6. Yes we are. Now what we're doing is a power upgrade on these. Um, and not so much by increasing the power input, but decreasing the the drag on the output. The, all the the crap, the safety stuff they put in there to like wussify the gun. So what we've got is the Kidwell modification for it works on pretty much all the standard Nerf guns that we've been able to find. Yeah. Um, all the CS6 all series the, for all sure. The, uh, what what are these things called again? End strike. Well, yeah, it's, well, it's the, the end strike series. End strike yeah. series is what we've been working on, and again, same tube, same yep. seam. they're right all exactly there. the they're same. They're identical. The, the internal mechanism's the same. So you ready? Wanna? Yeah, we just. All right, I'll, I'll show them how it's done. What we've got here, the the only unusual tool you'll need is you need to make a tool out of a piece of one half inch diameter copper pipe. Outside diameter. Yeah, outside diameter. Okay, copper pipe is usually sold by the inside diameter. This is half an inch outside diameter. And the way to tell, you don't need to bring calipers to the store or anything. Just bring one of your darts with you, which if you've got a Nerf gun, you've already got. And you'll notice that the dart matches the diameter of the tube. They are the same. Same. If you can line them up. I can line them up. It's hard. I'm trying to do it looking at the monitor, so it's messing with me. So there, you see, the tube and the dart are the same size. So just take a dart with you to the store. You'll be all set. Mm -hmm. Now, what you do is you take out your trusty Gerber, or just whatever metal file you happen to have, and you file down the edges here, like that. And Cut you see some saw teeth. Yeah. Manly, manly saw that, teeth. That took me five minutes. I yeah, mean, it's and copper, with, with your Gerber. So, with my Gerber. Yeah. It's soft copper, and you just... The funny thing is, we've done a few guns with this so far, and you can see these are rounded over. Yeah, well, it's, yeah. it's cop copper. It's soft. Yeah, but I mean, we're just cutting plastic. I didn't realize yeah. it was that okay. abrasive. Oh, yeah. Cool. All right. Well, I'm going to leave them kind of rounded over because it's the better. The more we do this, the better they're getting. So okay. I think it's because we're we're melting through more than yes. cutting. So they don't need to be really sharp. You just want to have little nibs, and you just chuck it up in a regular half inch drill. And you're set. That's all you got to do. That's that's the custom tool you'll need. You'll need that, and uh, you're going to want to have a bit of a coat hanger with a little hook bent in the end. There's, yeah. there's your high-tech bend. The other there's my end. I finger. Got, I cut the end of the hook off on the other end, so I bent it around, and then I got just a just little a, Just a little 90, hook. yep. And, and we, you're set. That's really, that's all you need. Just this and a piece of pipe. It's like the first gun, we, we didn't ready? really need this. The second gun, we really needed this. And yeah, it, your, your mileage will vary. You want to make sure to get all the pieces out. The, th the third gun we did, it was we didn't need it at all. All right, slide it in okay, there. Okay, hold on. And do you want to put we that can't, on? Well, they can't really see it on the camera. Oh, sure they can. It. Go ahead. Well, go. yeah, but here. Where's, where are we? Yeah, but there I have to. Are. All right, you got okay, it? Okay, I'm holding the bolt open a little bit. Okay. Okay, so there's... There we there's go. You the, can see it the coming cover in. going in. I'm going to hold... I'm holding on to the bolt, so I'm pushing forward on the bolt. Okay, you so ready? So we'll bring it back here to do the actual okay. cutting. Here we go. But go, go for it. All right, now you, you want to go at... It's not the feed speed, like how fast you're pushing this way. That's actually kind of slow. Just let, them, let the drill do the work. The actual rotational speed, you want to keep it kind of high, which would be unusual for like cutting plastic, but it's, I know it's weird, but trust us on this. You want to go kind of high because you want to actually melt your way through. It makes it smoother and it makes it easier to get all the stuff out with yeah, it. Yeah, the stuff comes out in the tool rather than falling yep, into the back yep. of the gun. Okay, you ready? I'm ready. I can feel the tube going in farther now. There's the first bit. Pull yeah. Okay, what do we got? Uh, we got some in there. Go ahead and tap. Just a little Hold bit. on, I'm gonna I'm going to uh There's the melted bit that we just okay. cut. And if I look in, I can see the little peg okay. still Let's in go. there. So we're gonna go some more. And you, you wanna do this in steps. You don't wanna go all at once. And you'll feel it go chunk when, when you hit a step. At that point, okay. you wanna stop, withdraw your tool, and then pull clean the, out the bits. Yeah, clean out the bits. Okay. You good? Yeah, go Here for it. Here we go. Now I'm pushing slower now. Just easing in. Go. 
go. Okay. And I got lots of stuff in yep, there. Yep, yep. And it looks like we wound up with some stuff in there. So All right. here. Actually, no, push it in from the other end. Remember, it was easier then. Right. And that's hot. Yeah, it gets, it gets toasty. Friction, Paul. You yeah. did a whole lesson on friction. All right. <laughs> I need a long tool. I got the long tool. Give, give me that before this cools down. OK. I'm just going to push it right out the back. And there's the, there's the peg. Yep, there's the peg. Here. I'll try not to, like, you know, chew my hand up with it. Yeah. Put it right out. See, there's a little burr on our other end of the pipe, so I got a good grip on it. Get out of my way. That's oh, man, on there, Paul. Go ahead, Paul. Well, you twisted. I'm a twister. I'll let you work on that. All I right. got to get the bits out. Because there's here. a burr on the other end of the pipe, so it's kind of hard to get all the crap out okay. of it. Okay, this one is a little darker than the other guns inside, so it's a little harder for me to see. There got it. Go. <laughs> so here's the bit to get out. You get the, uh, oh, you're, you're blocking my camera here. You get a little plastic bit with the restrictor plates. This usually has this attached, so it'll probably look like that when you get it out. Sometimes the bit breaks off. And you'll get a lot of chewed up plastic tube, and you get the little, I call it the pizza center, because it looks like the thing that comes when you get a pizza, except smaller. Um, Why? Cameraman's laughing at me. It does look like a little pizza thing. Look. This little pizza thing. Like it comes in and holds a box up, keeps some pizza. It's a pizza part. Chris, what? You're dumb. It's a pizza part. You're dumb. I'm calling it the pizza part. Shut up. Okay, there went a ring. I still haven't seen the spring yet, Paul. I I can see the spring. Because okay. now I have a preventative measure when you throw things at me. Safety first. How does this gonna work, Chris? <laughs> I'm just saying, I got Paul covered. I'm not gonna shoot Paul. Okay. Yeah, you're gonna, gonna shoot. You're gonna shoot him. Exactly. I'm a nice guy. You don't want to shoot me. Okay, I'm having a little vision issue here because you want me to do the, that? the inside of this one is darker because it's dark. Plastic. You know, man of your age and all. You want me to have a look in there? It's like I can hear it. I can hear the spring. Yeah, the there's always after you drill out. There's always a little bit of fishing bits out to get all the parts out, but and you want to get them all out because it can jam up if you don't. Yeah. Okay. Oh, there's that's you better light. Yeah. Okay. Just get, I just had to line it up right so I could get some light shining down in there so I can see. That's act. Oh, that's actually helping. Yeah. Hey, what a concept. Okay. Shine a flashlight in there and you can see better. Who'd have thought? Okay, I'm going to go down with the bigger hook. See what I need is a little camera that can see in there. You need a, yeah, you need like a bore light. Boroscope. Down Yeah, this one we've got all kinds of little... It's like I'm hooked on the uh, other side of the plug. There you go. Okay. I don't know if I got it there, but shine some light in. Did a piece come out? Yeah. 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 All right, I didn't, I, hold on. Yeah, I it went over that way. It the is spring is still inside there. Yeah, it's but it's definitely not. Huh? It's not, trust me. It's what not is? what? That's what, wow. Uh, yeah, yeah that's, that's, the, that's half the spring. That's half the spring oh, and a okay. big piece of plastic. So there there you can see it. That's, that's what they tend to look like when you get them out. I thought that was a whole spring. There's like no, a little piece of the that's that, most of the spring. There's a little piece of the spring that I think melted into the side. I don't think that's I don't know if that's spring or not. That's Let me see it. oh it's definitely spring. Give me one sec. Well go ahead. Is that okay? Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, that's major I don't think that's gonna cause us any trouble. Oh, I see the problem. Here, let me yeah. let me ream just a little yep. bit. Because it broke off, there isn't a full loop to grab onto. See if that's any better. Not even a little. Well, give it a shot. I think it'll be fine. It should be, because that, that should be behind the mechanism. There's a... 
Yeah, it looks fine. Oh, that sounds. It's yeah, it's definitely instantly like violent. So. Oh wow, that's oh that's a whole new weapon. Where's yeah? I got where is it? Thank you. Oh wow, I'm up fully like three feet. It took three foot of drop out of it. That's great. I can actually hit what I aim for now. That's that's so cool. That's Kidwell modification on the long strike CS6 nerf weapon. It is absolutely awesome. I think we did good. Today. I think we did good. I yeah, think this we is did. cool. This is cool. So you guys have fun. I'm Chris Bowden. Yeah, subscribe, rate. You're supposed to say I'm Paul Kidwell. You didn't, well, okay. I'm Paul Kidwell. Start over. So you guys have fun. I'm Chris Bowden. I'm Paul Kidwell. Please remember to rate, comment, subscribe. You can learn all about the Geek Group at thegeekgroup.org. And if you're watching this video, you should be a member. It's a place for guys like you to get together and tinker and modify your toys and make all kinds of new toys. We make Tesla coils and lightning machines and all the other cool stuff you'll see in our videos here. So check out our videos, learn all kinds of stuff. And uh, that's pretty much it, isn't it? Yes, I believe right. so. You know what it's time for, Paul. Gunfight, gunfight, gunfight. You guys have fun. Oh, man, I'm going to hurt you. <laughs> we'll see you next time here at the Geek Group. Ah. I'm not firing. Good. Yeah. <laughs> ah. What was that? That was trash can. <laughs> that, that's a wonky part. Yeah. I don't like that. <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh, this is much better. You suck so <laughs> bad. <laughs> oh, man, I'm busting parts why, off. Why is it always you two against me every <laughs> time? <laughs> oh, yes! <laughs> You're going down, bitch. You're going down. <laughs> Fine. Reload! This video was made possible by a grant from the Future Girl Foundation. This video was made possible by thousands of private donations from members and viewers like you. Please visit thegeekgroup.org for more information on how you can donate and become a part of our dreams of Avalon. At the camera. What? I can't see. What oh, see? it's right there. <laughs> what? What? You get? Look! Look at the monitor. Okay. It's well, right there. Oh, you got him. Well. <laughs> <laughs> Boom! Headshot.